insanely high water level. It's not unusual what you say with anyone. But if I ever find that you've changed at any time, When it's cold outside. Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Right, today we're doing a oh, rather large, oh hello, look at that. One pence corner has gone into a, should bloody check the pockets before then. Um, we're doing a load of woolens, but we're going to be doing it on the, oh someone's been picking up a lot of coins. We'll be doing it on the automatic 40 cycle with a soak. Uh, then the only option left to do on that is pre-wash. And then we've completed the automatic 40 cycle. We're now onto a detergent I don't like. Surf tropical lily and yang yang. Mang mm -hmm. it said. And comfort creations strawberry lily. You can do it. You can do it with water plus, and do it with soak. Start. This cycle only does a 900 RPM final spin as opposed to 1300, so it gets you to spin your life afterwards. And that's a 40 degree cycle. Oh, it's on the soak. Keep going. So on the soak, it goes from. Let's go soak and then wash. It's only five minutes on actually, because that was only an hour and 41. <clears throat> Alright, so it's just takes it as a larger load. It will keep changing on this cycle, I've forgotten. It will keep varying. Water plus for a woolen load. Okay. I don't know if it's heating up. No, oh, I know it does it when it's soaked. Okay, well now we're on the uh, soak stage. We're just actually heating up. And uh, Jerry, it's about 40. 
going to like, I think she does the high dramatic washer of them, 55 and 40 RPM, and then after a few tumbles, she stops and sits in the heat again. Nothing interesting happens there, just. Just the sound of the heating element. Oh, and you'll see the water level going back because it's all the clothes releasing their water. You can probably hear that. It's the heating element. Mm. You should get better rinsing performance on this side because it does a progressive spin. God, there won't be any more coins in there. Probably sits there for about <clears throat> two or three minutes. She'd been doing it for about 30 seconds before I recorded, started recording, so. As. God, that's like murky, that's murky water, that is. We'll be, we had to do a lot, we, had, we left this wash for quite a while because also we didn't need any jumpers or anything. Yeah, you can see it very slowly it will be increasing. It won't feel any heat though. <laughs> Alright, um, I'll see you on the main wash then. I'm on the main wash now. Uh, we're doing the high dramatic wash of 55 and now 40 RPM. And we are heating to 40. We are currently at about 35. So pretty good wash action, as you can see. I love the sound of the hoodie zips like tumbling around and hitting the door glass. There. They're actually more brighter than what they're appearing on here. Uh, more darker, sorry, than what they're appearing on here. Okay. Yeah, well, that's uh, from a distance. 52 minutes to go. See you on the intermediate spin. Okay, we're now on the first intermediate spin. I've forgotten what the spin pattern is on this cycle. I know that the second one is, is, a, is a four burst one, I think. Oh, we are unbalanced. Nice suds lock. Whoa! Oh god, I've never seen it do that. Covered it. Uh, I think it's the second one, it does 400, 600, no, four, I think it's 400, 500, 600, then it does the progressive spin up to 900. Let's do this in there. Second burst, uh, I'm probably thinking this is going to be a 600 RPM. Should we see what the verdict is? Balanced or what? Are we unbalanced? No, balanced. Ooh. It's a woolen's load of absorbent. Oh god, I covered it. I think that's all it does for that one. Okay, now on the first rinse. I uh, presume this is going to be a deep level rinse. It should do because it's a large load. Yeah, 24 minutes to go. Oh, hang on. I just remembered something about this cycle. Even if you click wall, if you select water plus. It only does two rinses. I'm sure that this is the one that the water plus does not have an effect on. That it only adds more water to it. Ah, yes, yes, it does. Well, still, that's probably why then it does a, a fast, a longer spin. I might do a descale, uh, sorry, maintenance wash later on with a, um, what's it called, the 
I was told by Mila that I can. Uh, I was told by Mila at the Experience Centre on the 13th that I can use uh, the scaling tablets. Uh, you know what you're using your iron and um, kettle. Um, so I can use that to put in the machine, and it won't do any harm. But I want to get hold of uh, Mila citric acid. So I can actually get that hold of that soon. Yeah, it's definitely going to be a high level rinse. Three, two, right, off this tumble. It'll stop filling. Three, and three, two, one. There we are. Lovely. <clears throat> now, there many, many say that, like, there are a lot of people that don't like Mila that say that Mila don't use enough water well, I think that that's perfect enough for a rinse. Especially if it's only doing two rinses, then it will need to use a considerable amount of water. I don't know if these are 10 minute rinses, these ones. I can check what the rinse hold will be though. Oh, we're doing a five minute final spin. I think the final spin's gonna be very much like the, de it's like the denim cycle, that's it. It does a three bursts of like 600, I think. 400, 600, 600, and then it does the 900. We're on the second intermediate spin now. I think this is, yeah, this is the one that does the four burst, I think. What's its verdict? Oh, oh, that's pretty unbalanced, that is. Whoa! Nice. Second burst, I think this is the 600 RPM one now. And then, oh, it might do the 900 I want, 900 one off of this. Uh oh. Yeah, it looks unbalanced a little bit. Oh, yes. Nice sub lock. We could definitely the shock absorbers on that. It's just a Miele thing though, I think, because they've got a heavier suspension. Well, uh, we're actually into the final rinse, so it did not do the uh, progressive spin. Hmm, that's very strange why it didn't do that. Maybe, no, hang on. Oh, maybe it's not the automatic cycle it does that. Maybe it's the no, I think it's the Dark Garment Cycle that does it on. Uh, so I hardly ever use this portion of the, top of the dial, so I don't really know the programs that well. But I know the final spin is exactly the same as the Denim Cycle. Because it goes to 900 and it does like 2 or 3 bursts of 600. No, the first one being 400, the second being 600, and it does like a 700 burst. Then it goes up to 900 for like 30 seconds or something. We're on the final rinse now, probably will be a deep level, high level rinse. Oh, I just wish I could stick my head in that machine right now and just have all that cold water on me. It's so hot over it. Those, the majority of those watching in the UK will. I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't know if it's hot all the way over the UK. I know, definitely in London it is. Let's get, let's get the water level going up. And I'll be using the spin dryers outside. Will annoy, will annoy the neighbours. <laughs> nah, to be honest, they don't even know. No one's ever actually asked me to what they are. I don't know, the 302 one's going to rip up my carpet when I'm going to get that out of we go. It's quite a fast filler. Oh. And stop. No. Keep going. Oh gosh. Wow, that is a nice that is a nice water level that is. Wow. 
That's like they're trying to compete with Hoover then. Hoover logic. No, Hoover electrons. Alright, then I'll see you on the final spin then. Here we're now on the final spin. Uh, as I said, this should be exactly like the denim cycle. So, first place is about 400 RPM. We're going to get a water lock here. Oh, nicely balanced. Well. Oh. Nice. Now onto the second burst, which would be a, which will be a 600 RPM burst. Yeah, three minutes to go, so it does do three bursts before going up to 900. Uh-oh. No, no, no. Unbalanced. Whoa! <laughs> Millie's angry today. Oh, bit of a longer burst that was. Whoa! Hear that rubber seal creasing. Wow. That's the hoodies doing that. Because it's a mixture of hoodies and yeah, jumpers. I may have got the spin sequence wrong. I think this is the final ramp up to 900. Because that's about under two minutes now. Yeah, one minute. Right, this is the final ramp up to 900. Oh, we're nice and balanced. Take that back. Slightly unbalanced. We are, we're at 900 now. We're gonna, only going to do that for like 20 seconds or something. I don't know, maybe 30 seconds if we're lucky. That would be much more fun, to be honest. And there we are. I go this way, you can see that there is, you probably might be able to see there is a bit of side to side movement. Shock absorbers. Yeah, I think it's like, I mean, back and forth. There are, I love the sound of the shock absorber actually. That's like a meatless sort of sound. Just trying to chug. Oh, my hand's gone red. Looks like my hand's gone red from lying on the floor. Well, not lying, but sitting on the floor. All right, let's do this. So, transfer was to the spin dryers. I've not used them in so long. So, we're going to take them outside and, yeah, because then they won't vibrate the whole floor. Okay. So I'm not going to do my ending line there because I have to go upstairs. <laughs>